We're starting early. We have to beat this. We have to beat this. Muscle sore. We have to beat this. Sounds like murder mom's feeling more stabby than usual. You all right there, Drax? I am part during that question. And that makes total sense. After what happened with Nikki and that twisted promise, having to watch the people we love die all over again. My family did not simply die. Wait, do, do we, we have, have to go through all this dialogue, dialogue again? Thanos. I think I'm I do not wish to discuss it. Oh no. Yeah. <laughs> Why does she look at her head like that? Hey, Rocket, you got a minute? I bought something in nowhere to remove that Nova. <laughs> Piece of junk. Oh, how do I have to say? Fine. It's more fun crafting my stuff, but I'll lend you a paw. So this dialogue wasn't saved. I could really use a flark and drink right now. <laughs> Still can't believe Rocket got grifted by a girl. Oh, so all of it did count it. Okay, good shit. I thought I had to do all the damn dialogue again. Oh, what is she? Nice. What is she wearing? Is Rocket is Groot in here? <sighs> Bet our comms array wouldn't be all chewed up if we'd kept the llama in here. Ooh, so swirly. Is that even a plant? I wonder where Gru picked up that one. I bet Gru has a rich, velvety voice. <laughs> Let's talk to her. At least we're talking Watch to Peter. her. Hey, Gamora. Go away, Peter. Come on. Just thought I'd check in. That was some... Pretty heavy stuff you said earlier. Wanna talk about it? I don't need a pep talk. Why is she mad at me now? Okay. All right. No talking. Let's sing it out. What? Oh, oh, oh. who's the hunter? <laughs> who's the game? You feel the beat. Call your name. Come on, I know you know this one. I hold you close in victory. I don't want to tame your animal style. You won't be caged in the call of the wild. Come on, sing it! Shooting at the walls of... <laughs> Shooting at the walls of heartache. <laughs> the walls. I, I am, am the warrior. warrior. I, well, am I am the warrior. The warrior. Heart to heart you <laughs> win. <laughs> <laughs> See? Just singing. All right. I like that one. Gets me every time. What did you want to talk about? Want to talk about the guy whose arm you just ripped off? Nothing to talk about. You chopped his arm off. And that's all I did. He's still out there with Nikki manipulating her with his slick lies and flarked up promises. Making everybody think... <sighs> we can't bring them back. Who did you see? In your promise. Got a feeling it wasn't Thanos. Nothing, it was just a lie. Which is why we need to stop it. I'm working on that. Just try not to slash the cargo bay in half. Could you move? Damn. She's sashy. Alright. Let's say talk to everybody, huh? This rocket. One whole arm. That's what? 10% of Raker down? <laughs> Say we leave the other 90% alone. 
Can't say I ain't glad I get to dissect this little marvel. But that's as close as I'm getting to this Flarkin cult ever again. Hmm. All right, let's go. Let's go. Come on. Shoo, shoo. Move over. What are you looking at? No, you ain't chewing through any more of my ship. My ship. Why is some of this? Shoo, flark off. Wow, that panel must have looked really tasty. What's it for, anyways? Emergency door controls for the ship. Something a ship owner should know. Hey, do I look like an engineer? You don't. Right, let me Hope see. Somebody makes the right call and gets us out of the way of those church idiots. <laughs> it ain't cowardice, it's common sense. Wait, are you fighting with green? All right, so all right, we're good. Let's go continue. Let's continue our mission. Our mission. Anything yet? Guardian of Galaxies. Cosmo, buddy, where have you been? We've been calling you. Sorry, Peter Quill. Cosmo's bow's been tied. Universal Church of Truth arrive at nowhere. Are you okay? He's fine for a moment. Cosmo receive warning in time. But Continuum Cortex is of shutdown for safety. He's been dead, huh? Your little detective trip almost got us killed. We'll fill you in when we get there. Yet, this problem is bigger than Cosmo. Guardian of Galaxies must go to Xandar and ask World Mind for help instead. Cosmo unable to get through. Guardian of Galaxy must actually. Oh shit. Cosmo, are you there? What happened? Why a group? this? Church things? Are we under attack? So these are the cowards who defiled Lady Hellbender's honor. Oh, good. And who the flock are you? Normally, I would not engage in conversation with inferior life forms. Ooh, we're... But my contract with Lady Hellbender stipulates otherwise. Therefore, abomination. You may refer to me by my title. I am Captain Glory, leader of the Lethal. Lethal Legion. Lethal Legion. <laughs> uh, more like Loser Legion. <laughs> he surrounded us. Listen, I get that Lady Hellbender's super pissed, but now's really not the best time. Did you think that she would ease her bounty simply because you somehow managed to elude the Blood Brothers in nowhere? Yes. Then you were as imbecilic as they are. Lady Hellbender sends her regards, so called Guardians of the Galaxy. Prepare to be eliminated. No, you prepare to be eliminated. <laughs> Smooth. Uh, we got this. Probably. <sighs> go, go, go. I'm not familiar with Captain Glory. He looks like a douchebag. Hit them hard and give them no order. There's nothing on that garbage scow worth salvaging. He's got a piece of that guy! Hang in there, bud. They ain't killed us yet. Can't we just send an IOU to Lady H? She will receive your splinter remains. Well, they insulted my baby. Just keep watching. Ooh. Please try to flee. I would love to hunt you down. And feed your ego? No, thank you. These ships ain't dying fast enough. Fools! You face the best fighters in the galaxy. Yeah. Where? Where's 
Drax the Destroyer. My bounties for five as you. Ain't a bad question. Jeez, how much money did she offer these guys? More than that, crap. Only one lethal lame brain left. What is all we need? Woo! <laughs> Who's the inferior life form now, huh? Still you. Peter, I'm picking up something. What? It appears I'll have to finish this myself. Oh, shit. So you defeated my fighters. But my cruiser will crush you. Feels kind of good to have bounty hunters after us. It means we're making a name for ourselves, right? That's it? That's what you've been bragging about? What do you mean? <laughs> Nothing. It's... Oh. I'm sure it's very comfortable. It will not be mocked. Then do something about it. You get us killed, Quill. I'm gonna kill you. That did some real damage. Keep hitting his exhaust ports. Your strategy will work. Thanks. You just confirmed that it will. Lady Skull Suit us the worst flark in timing. Is she here? Just her goons. This time. Moron. Protect our point. This guy started to sound like rocket. It's called language efficiency, Quill. Fuck him up. Starting to feel like you pissed off the whole galaxy. A good chunk of them anyway. Really need to work on our PR. Stay in there, Cap. Stay still, and I'll show you. Yeah, I don't think the scrap sacks care if the galaxy's under siege. You know, contractors. We're contractors. Proves his point. We just tried to dump the problem on somebody else. Ooh. Right up the exhaust port! Just kill them already! There's an arc to this! Ha! Quill just drives the kill plane to the deadliest woman in the galaxy! We're hit! Most. We really gotta take better care of the Milano! Yeah! A ship washing the wax when the stone. Right after you, I am Clary, warrior. Of... <laughs> <laughs> he laughs. Take that, Lady Skull Scut. I doubt we've seen the last of her. We'll worry about Lady Hellbender later. Let's just focus on getting to Xandar. Punch it. <laughs> he laughs as he flew up. <laughs> I think Rock is the most evil one out of all of them. I think so. Yeah. Old girl needs a tune-up. We can do it once we reach the station. I ain't letting no bucket head near my... Wow. So, talk about cosmic gridlock. I haven't seen this many ships around Xandar since the start of the Galactic War. Open channel, Groot. Let's see what's going on. These ships come from converted worlds. They're refugees. I need immediate docking permission. Please answer us. Groot, that's enough. I don't see any rescue shuttles coming out. They're ignoring them. No. No, 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 no. Nova Corps might be a bunch of self-righteous dome heads, but they're they're supposed to be helping folk. That's their whole flark and deal. Relax, Rocket. We'll just call the station and ask to speak to the world mind. Group. <sighs> Welcome to Nova Corps headquarters. Please state your preferred language of communication. What's this? How may we assist you? We 
should report what Raker is up to. Think the Flarkin world mind doesn't already know? We are aware of the current threat, but can devote no resources toward fighting it. Just pick something, Peter. After scanning your ship, our near-perfect algorithms pre-selected several officer choices. The allocation of resources for direct communication with us they look has been denied. I didn't even we notice that. For the inconvenience. Well, it was worth a shot. Let's try something else. I suggest the congratulations on your decision to join the Corps. To begin, state your full name, designation, or serial number. Ryder. Quill's mom. Quill's mom. <laughs> Strategy is futile. Ah, oh, come on, muscle brain. It might work. Please oh, save your you. celestial body. Or artificial, artificial installation of origin. Quill's mom. Earth. Earth. I continue to doubt this strategy. Finally, in a few words, describe what made you want to join Nova Corps. Because I'm a sucker. Justice. Looks like the best AI in the world can parse that. Good job, boys. <laughs> Not today. Because I'm Justice. <laughs> All right, so that was fun, but a complete waste of time. Any other ideas? How about future crime? Thank, Thank you for being proactive. However, However the, the galaxy's, galaxy's impending doom makes all future crimes irrelevant. Should tell them about the promise. Connecting to begging. Believe that worked. Gardeners of the galaxy. <laughs> Explain yourselves. Is hey, this? world mind, long time no see. It's me. Dear Quill, Star Lord. And uh it's Guardians of the Galaxy. Check the addendum. We need your help. To pay a fine? No. No, of course not. You need to save the, the galaxy. galaxy cannot be saved, Peter Quill. What? A mass delusion known as the promise. Is sweeping its systems, converting all who encounter it. In less than three cycles, it has spread from the crew of a single star frigate to multiple outposts, worlds, and systems. Praxis 9, Rigel 3. 75.222% of the Andromeda Galaxy, all lost. Of course, she don't mention Contraxia. They, actually, the world mind has collected consciousness. Look. We know who's behind the promise. We've seen it happening up close and personal. We're here to pass on information to you so you can stop it. How can we be more clear? The Universal Church of Truth cannot be stopped. Told you, they're a collective. It is a machine. Yeah, well, so are parts of me. And you better not call me in it. Look, we just escaped the Church's mothership. We have a ton of intel you can use to bring them down. There is nothing you can tell us we do not already know. Pretty sure I know a few things that even a supercomputer can't know. Such as? Well, how to groom the feathers on a Shi'ar warbird, for starters. Are you still alive? Because I know how to groom the feathers. <laughs> <laughs> I know how to lay the pipe. Well, I know where you can buy hack Nova Corps helmets at ridiculously discounted prices. What? They obviously don't know about it, or they do something. The point is, we've lived things, experienced things. We've survived the promise, and maybe our experience can be used to help you bring them down. It is possible. We have overlooked the value of individual experiential memories stored within our files. Good. So let's pull resources. However, given the ill-defined parameters of such a query, undertaking a search protocol at this time is advised. Now. If you will excuse us. The Universal Church of Truth's forces draw closer to this region of space. It is critical that we depart before they arrive. You're running away? What about the refugees? You're just gonna leave them defenseless? Our primary directive is the preservation of Zandarian culture. All else is secondary. <laughs> Have you seen what your planet looks like? Zandarian culture is a lost cause. But you're Nova Corps' leader. You have a duty to protect this galaxy. That, that is incorrect. You ain't the leader of the Bucketheads? 
We do not have a duty to protect this galaxy. We merely police it to get advanced knowledge of potential threats. Serve and protect only yourselves. A logical byproduct of our primary directive. We have officers all over the galaxy laying down their lives for you. And you won't even risk fighting for their sake? The risk is too great. It would be a pointless sacrifice. Wow, I know what that means. The church is stopped by the That's resources. So messed up. Its influence has grown beyond all probabilistic models. Then update your models. We cannot can adjust our computations to the enemy's nonsensical power source. You mean faith energy? Faith, as an energy source, is illogical. We are unable to compute scenarios to fight that which should not exist. So you're just gonna let the church win? If the power source cannot be quantified, it cannot be countered. Most sentient beings don't have the luxury of calculating their odds before getting into a fight. That is why they fail. Don't you control the Nova Force? The magical energy that powers Nova Corps? It... is not magical. But yes. Then how do you explain that one? Because to an outsider, it doesn't seem logical at all. Thanos used to say it was generated by the living computers of Xandar. The, the living computers of Xandar are the Nova Force. It exists because we exist, and we exist, therefore it does. Sounds like you're able to harness your collective energy just like Breaker. It's a cool, cool design. design. I didn't, I didnn't know, know about the world computer. You do, I didn't know, know how the church does. anything, anything about, about Nova Corps. Perhaps. You, you have given us new data to consider. Guardians of the Galaxy, we will. Later. Right now, we need to focus on our departure. You're still leaving? We did not make this decision without considering all available options. A complete search of our databanks only revealed a single entity with the potential to stop them. What is it? Not what. Who? Adam Warlock. Ooh. The Church's original Golden God. Unfortunately, he perished in the last year of the Galactic War. Great. So, no one? We are, we are pleased you reached the same conclusion we did. It appears that our travel preparations are almost complete. Farewell, no Guardians of the Galaxy. No, 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 wait! Classic Nova Corps. Ain't helped us then, you won't help us now. Damn, Damn that, that sucks. sucks. What? Are you kidding me? Groot says the Flarkin helpline's still asking for fine money. Huh. Uh, yeah. Let's get this over with. Confirm payment. I only have 500. Oh, come on, really? I knew it! I knew you spent Lady Hellbender's money in nowhere. You saw me? You were there? I was watching your back. Great. All the way to Seknar from back, and nothing to show for it. I'm sorry, all right? <sighs> We've got movement. I'm good. They're taking off. Yep. Quill? Quill? I see it! <sighs> oh shit! Smack. Jump, Quill. I know. Trump's promise is becoming real. Peter? We gotta get clear first. Come on. And go! Shit, they're everywhere. Scott! Whoa! What did you do? I don't know. Why have we stopped? The loser legion must have hit something when they ambushed us. Guys, 
It's only a matter of time before the galaxy accepts the promise. Sacrosanct is back there. We can't just sit here. Guys. And how are we going to do that? We're dead in the flock and water. If they find that, we're screwed. Freely accepted. Oh, yeah. And without an engine, we're screwed but anyways, anyway. guys, guys, guys. Enough. Just stop already. I can't hear myself think. Rocket, fix the engines. How am I supposed to do that? I can't even run a diagnosis. I don't care! Just fix it! Scoff? And what are we supposed to do? I don't know, okay? I can't just conjure up answers every two seconds. Fine. Don't. I just... can't do this right now. <sighs> I need some rest. Damn. It's getting kind of hopeless, isn't it? Screw Noble Corps. Shouldn't have counted on them in the first place. He's starting to act like he's gonna fucking accept the promise. I, uh, I do not wish to talk. Fair enough. We're all pretty spent, just... Try to get some rest if you can. Yeah, I think he saw his wife and kid. Like, he wants to see him again. Look, it's our great leader. Hey. Here to yell at me some more? What? No. I really don't feel like small talk. Forgot your toast. Oh, look at that toaster. It's like a... It's like a pyramid. Where's everybody? He's in my bed! Hey, how did you... Aww. Come on, girl. Shoo, shoo. Aww. <laughs> What the? what the f That's how you got in? She ate a hole in his wall? Better hope it doesn't eat through the hull. How the fuck did that goofy ass llama do that? The little teeth? And the bed smells. Great. This part is over. We try to reach the soul. Raccoon's waiting for you. Everybody is. Uh, Rocket, yeah, he was fixing that thing that broke. Hey, if we're some kind of big space hero now, why are we running from the bad guys? <sighs> it's complicated. No, it's not. Stop running. And we've landed. What the uh... fuck? Oh, is, <clears throat> is this that shit again? <sighs> Making me see shit? Root wanted to let you sleep. Can you believe it? Oh, how long was I out? Enough to fly us all the way to the quarantine zone. How do we fly out here? Quill, do you want to fix your ship or not? Ship. Yes, your ship. Come on, the others are outside. What? Is everyone outside already? Yep, waiting for us. Where the fuck are we? There. Let's go. Huh? How do we get the ship moving, though? This is not right. There's something wrong. Look with who this. stumbled out of bed. The rodent made decisions in your sleep. Yeah, yeah, I know. Took you long enough. What? 
Oh shit. You're not supposed to be here. You promised you would get me out of here. I know, but... Nikki! Guys, don't let it get to you! Won't have to tell me twice! Freaking me out, man. I had to share the good news, Peter Quill. You have lost your family. Your mother. The Kree woman. You understand the pain that comes from loss. Drax. With faith. With the Matriarch's promise, our families can be restored. I... I Drax, I don't... You have accepted her promise, have you not, Peter Quill? Uh... Not exactly, but, but but not because I don't want to. It's just I have questions. I understand. The matriarch's promise is overwhelming. Overwhelming is a word for it. It also took me time to see the miracle of her promise. What the fuck? Oh, yes, shit. yes, a uh, time. I just need a time. I will give you time, Peter Quill. However, I am less certain of the others. You're not going to attack them. One may come around, but I suspect the assassin and the rodent will resist. Mm -hmm. This makes them a dangerous element to our cause. I must eliminate them. Wait! Why? <laughs> These are our family, man. Just give them a chance. It's a lot to process. You truly believe they will accept her promise? I, I know it. Uh, take Gamora. Her dad was Thanos. There's gonna be some stuff to work through before she can accept it. And, and Rocket. <laughs> Where to start? He's literally a walking science experiment. What Nikki, uh, the, the matriarch, is, is offering, it's, it's all new territory for him. And the wooden one? You said it yourself. You'll come around. I mean, it's Groot, man. He's our rock. Very well, Peter Quill. Good, uh, good. He's still that's, rational in a way. That's great. Um, I'll, I'll let the others know. No, I will fetch her and bring her to you. How? She's like a million light years away. We have already landed on our 
planet. What? Think well, Peter Quill. When I return, she will demand your answer. What hey, the fuck? Drax. He doesn't know there's a hole to shoot this. through. Great. I'm here, Rocket! Oh, thank Flark. Peter? Rocket? Why is my door locked on the outside? Yeah. Drax may have kind of joined the church. What? Seriously? I know, it's, it, it's super messed up, Drax.